Paradise cannot be found. It must be built. Paradise cannot be found. It must be built. Mm. I'm sure I agree with that. I'm, sure you can, I'm pretty sure you can find paradise and natural beauty. Lots of natural... Uh, naturally occurring spots, so... Up and down. Attach the fan. There's a converter, RGB converter up there as well. We need to take blue from there. That's going to open that. And we have limited resources here. There's a fan there. That's interesting. Okay. Okay, so we need to swap an item here. Take this. So... We could effectively have a red... I wasn't talking to you, sorry. Um, we, need to the, we need to have the blue. But it's interesting that... Let's take this for the moment. Don't believe this is the right thing to swap it with. So we're just kind of playing around right now. It would kind of make sense to do... Okay, I, I kind of see what I need to do there, actually. Take that. It's going to go there. That and that will give us a red. We can't see that from there, so we're going to have to take this up to the top. But then, so we're going to do that. That's going to give us a red, and then we're going to need to RGB convert that back to blue to open this here. Now, um, the question is, what don't we need? We obviously need to get up to here. So to get up to there, we take the fan. Let's take the converter for now. Maybe it's the box we don't need. Maybe it is the box. Um, if we didn't need the box though, why would it give it to us there? I don't... That seems a little bit weird, doesn't it? A little bit bizarre. But yeah, effectively... We're going to kind of do that and that. That's going to give us the blue red. And then we're going to use that RGB converter there. But what can we use now to swap?
be also the problem with putting that up there. Prevents us from doing. Do that. There's nothing over there, is there? I'm not getting desperate, I'm just exploring. There we go. We got it. Turn into a puzzle for a second attempt. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I... I kind of like alluded to the fact that I thought the block box was pretty useless when I first started like trying to solve it. So New York was a place that aroused great passion. Some loved it and called it the greatest city in the world. Others hated it and called it the ugliest cesspit full of rude snobs. I don't know what the truth like where the truth lies, but I know it was a place full of life. There was always something new going on, people rushing about and excitement in the air. It must have been over and over a sensation to stand in the canyons formed by those great skyscrapers in a crowd of people, feeling history happening all around you. Is, I mean, is that what New York looks like, like in today, like in the game? That's pretty interesting. 
Yeah, yeah, I, I know. I, I know that I left and came back, but technically I didn't, but it's fine. Minor technicality. technicality. What you were stuck on is that you always use the inverter as an input for the RGB converter, not output. Ah. Right, okay, where was that Prometheus spark? I believe it was somewhere over here. Yes, here it was. Ah. We need to bust something out. I wonder if we can bust something out of Puzzle 6. The walls are pretty low around the outside, I think. Sure, LB broke it. Oh, yeah, that's terrible. How dare you? Such an upstanding member of the puzzle puzzle solving community. I need an item. That's one way to trap yourself. <laughs> oh. Time to reset. Gonna have to pile it up for pile along. Um not sure if we uh cut the spoilers to a minimum, please, if you don't mind, but welcome on in. Alright, let's go tackle number seven. Portion.
excellent solution. Why, thank you, Byron. I didn't see the name. It sounded like Byron. It doesn't sound like Byron. Byron's got a high pitched voice. Uh, yeah, you're right, Albie. You are right. Well, I guess that's what I get for trying to, like, sneakily dump something outside the puzzle. Can't take the driller through its own hole. Hmm. Here we yet also to find the other final lost puzzle. <laughs> Hey, you got one thousand duplicate red. I am assuming is going to activate the fan, which is going to get us to the exit. We have a red there with a tunneling device. I believe that's tunneling device. I right, have a jammer, so we're going to want to drop. Drop down to here potentially, I okay, can't. Was insane. Let's take control of this dude. And then we can swap the jammer for this. I mean. Gonna be some sort of connector here. Yep, there is. But we need to swap an item. Ah. What item can we swap there? could be quite clever. with the fan temporarily. Ice the driller.
Oh, but then, hold on. Oh, maybe I got my... Good. I don't think I can... Hmm. I was kind of hoping that I could... Put that jammer on here and then maybe... From the underside... Certainly get that out. Another uh, voice memo recording over there. I need to try and remember that when we've done this puzzle. So here's what I was thinking, like, put the jammer on the top, swap the fan with the tunneling device, use the tunneling device to drop the jammer down a level, swap everything back. Actually, yeah, as long as I can... Okay, no, that's it. That's it. Okay. As long as I can see the uh, my other character, that's fine. So do that. Oh... The issue though, isn't it? Can't take that and do that. Mm, well, actually, I potentially could if I take my character out here again. Okay, maybe, yeah, maybe this is what we do. So we swap that temporarily. Right, that's fallen down. Excellent. Can we swap this around again? We send one of our characters to here. But we need the tunneling device again. I just soft lock this. I don't think I've now got a way. It's almost like I needed to have it. It's almost like I need to have the jammer pointed at the field before it drops. But I don't think that would work. I, I do think I'm soft locked. Because I don't see a way now to use this. Without doing like taking everything back. Okay, we got everything back. I'm 
time. What if we took the jammer? It does seem to me like you would have to have the driller The driller needs to be down there How do I do this with that person? Do I do it with one person? I'm going around in circles by doing this, but you know, I don't think this is the right thing to do.
definitely can't take the fun up there. I don't think it makes sense to take the, the tunneling portal device up there either. So I think I definitely got to use the jammer. Um. I've got to be able to... I'm an item. Let me swap with you. Okay, let me test something here. Yeah. Okay, that doesn't do what I wanted it to do. I didn't do what I wanted to do. Okay. I can stand up here now. Don't need to worry about that button. So now I can take this off here. And... And swap that to there. Take the jammer. Okay. Let's bring it out. We got there. <laughs> yeah. Just gotta think these things through. We get there eventually. Miranda, would you like to play a game? Jeez. What is this, Saw? You want to play a game? That sounds like fun. It is. Remember? And she sounds sinister. Remember what Alexandra Drennan said about games? They're part of what makes us human. Exactly. And this is a game Alexandra Drennan designed when she was still in school. It's based on her favorite book. Have a go. Okay. All right, final puzzle of the area. Maybe I've watched too many horror films. Okay. Classic Talos here, I think. Jammer to jam that. Needs red. 
Okay. Classic Talos is kind of like what by what I mean that by that kind of like a um Oh I wonder. I wonder. Right, so I, I never really articulated what I was um, saying there, but like by what I meant by class, classic Talos was like you have a jammer in either side of an area and you kind of have to open it with one, go through to the other, open it with the other, then bring the other device through. Obviously, it's not the case here, but it was kind of there. Oh, I put the fan piece there, didn't I? Okay, I'm gonna need to use that. Uh, yeah, okay. I need to use something else for the... Well, I guess I don't need the jammer, actually. I could use the jammer instead of the fan. That would make more sense at the minute, I guess. Then say that. And now I don't have that to do that. Ah. Not think I can say one K like this before. Wait, why one K has? not have any other name of 1k all the others are human names and they're according to numbers but they have but why 1k doesn't have a human name can the actual player think of themselves 1k i imagine um well i i don't know maybe somebody correct me but i believe don't they say in the story that like everybody has kind of um each of the characters pick their own names if i remember rightly so i'm assuming that because 1k is um brand new so to speak, to the world and the environment. I'm assuming, uh, he, and we've kind of like gone straight on this expedition. He hasn't really had time to come up with a name yet. I need this. This device is a need. Take the fan for now. I don't know what you're talking about, LB. Plenty of room. That jammer is pretty useless. We don't need the jammer. We need the fan piece. We need the driller, because we need to connect everything up. We need the fan piece. I feel like I'm missing something.
feel like I'm missing something. Like an item. Unless this is the big hoax. I'm guessing we need to do that as well. Maybe we go across there on our own. Although we can't, because we need... Okay. But we need to get the fan piece first. Then we don't need to get the fan piece first. We need to get the jammer. Pop that with the connector. there and there. That's actually really clever. The, the order of events and the reuse of elements there is really, really clever. I like that. I like that a lot. Now, we're still missing that one idea, aren't we, about getting an, an element out of the puzzle for that Prometheus Spark, uh, Prometheus Spark, Prometheus Spark. Um, however, um, we're not too concerned about those. So, I'm going to simply head over to Tromino's Pizza, and we're going to we're going to uh, get into the middle. Uh, well, we've, got, we've got about an hour and a quarter left of the stream, so on the, like I said, on the assumption we are going back to the mega structure. We might have time to do it tonight. We might not. So, one side of the gate's almost done.
Wait a minute. and she will do anything to prevent you from reaching the flame. It is she who disrupted the trials of the Sphinx, and who bound me in the... Who bound you in the what? In the chains? Why did you get cut off, I wonder? Well done, 1K. Looks like our hypothesis was correct. The mega structure is opening again. Everyone, come to the VTOL, please. It's time to find Athena. What about Pandora? She seems capable of displacing or controlling the other entities. We should be careful, but we can't let such a vague threat paralyze us. Just keep your eyes open. I'm keeping my eyes open. Do the mega structure we get. Yep, we got both sides. Something I've been thinking about. I know the new Alexandria disaster was traumatic. I know accidents like that make us think that it's best to stick to what we have. But what about all the accidents that have happened in New Jerusalem that nobody talks about? The collapse of the Vukovsky building. When we was going the around Calvin the Street explosion. When we was going around the side, uh, I think it was to puzzle six. I noticed that one of the structures of the like the mega structure in the middle was they had a strut coming down. So I actually, before I went in the puzzle, I went up the strut and I caught the shard and followed it to its um, endpoint. So yeah, we did get it. The derailment that almost killed Benaroya and Canada. All of those happened because we stopped investing enough resources in our civilization. And if Melville hadn't been put in charge of city maintenance, this would still be happening. It will happen again, either way. With how little we have to work with, it's only a matter of time. You see, there may be a price for pursuing progress, but there's also a price for not pursuing. Indeed. All right, back to the VTOL we go. This and everybody else is. No, oh, it's like a. Interesting. All right. Here we go again. Our main objective is to determine the relationship between the megastructure and Athena. Did she find it? Did she build it? Why was she here in the first place? Explore, dig up anything you can. We need to start finding answers. I can't imagine one person building all this. Don't forget about Miranda. There were at least two of them. I can't imagine a hundred people building this. All right, everyone. Have a look around, but stay in touch and be careful. 1K, can you stay a moment? I'd like to talk to you. 
Yo, what's up, Alcatraz? I know you can't wait to... I'm concerned. Byron is brilliant, but all he can think about is the possibility of finding Athena. She was his mentor, and her disappearance shattered him. I'm afraid he's not seeing the dangers of the megastructure. To me, this place seems chaotic, dysfunctional. Yes, it's all very impressive, but I think it's broken. And what we're seeing is, uh, it's nonsense, frankly. You've interacted with it more than anyone. What do you think? Ah. Yeah, I, I don't know. I understand what he's saying. I do feel the same about Byron, that he's kind of just focused on finding Athena. I think there seems to be some way, however they kind of drifted apart or separated, I don't think he... I know it sounds weird talking about robots, but I don't think he kind of dealt with it properly. I think he's like made it his mission almost to go and find Athena. <clears throat> so he's potentially got a jaded kind of viewpoint on everything that that's what he's going for um as for where like everything's broken i mean it does kind of seem weird that the whole place is similar to the simulation in the fact that we kind of have to do puzzles to be able to progress and almost like the puzzles are fixing broken things um but yeah i, I don't know um is it a case that everything got locked off and to protect something from from some to protect something or some one from something? I'm not sure I have enough data really to take a, a, a side here. I, I really I, I don't know which way I, I sw swing on this. I don't know if it's an intentional. If it was intentional though, why? it taken this long for Prometheus to like show up as a vision and almost like summoners to the island hmm. I'm, I'm gonna take the cop out answer here and say that I don't have enough data to judge then just be careful okay all right let's go explore I'm headed deeper into the megastructure. Not quite sure where I am. Seem to be right in the middle of the machinery. Please, watch yourself, Byron. This is incredible. I don't even know how to describe what I'm seeing. I don't think this is a building. Doctor? I think this is a machine. Hey, welcome back, LV. Oh, and by the way, you, uh, you you failed this assignment back two decades ago. Can you please hand it in? Thank you. Pulse leads air frustration. Effects ripple out at enormous distance waves. We need to move experiments further apart interesting can we literally bootstrap this to any scale um interesting that they're saying we need to move the experiments further apart so is it a case that like the whole island because it's so spread out is a case that whatever is happening here that's the reason everything is so spread out in like the the different segments and sectors ah. Oh, we're glitching. We got a glitch. Why don't you just tell people that they're wrong? If you tell them the truth, they'll listen. It's not that simple. 
Straton oh, wrote that the most Sarasov. common error we commit okay. is to think that ideas determine reality, when in fact the opposite is true. Ideas follow from material conditions. Belief systems are formed to explain and justify the way we live. We did not have kings because we believed in the mandate of heaven. We believed in the mandate of heaven because we lived in monarchies. But we have free will. Oh, free will isn't the same as freedom, Miranda. We're not free from the constraints of reality or history. I was shaped by the simulation. New Jerusalem is shaped by its limitations. So what? We're just trapped? History can only go one way? Maybe, maybe not. The question is, how do we free ourselves? How do we build a world where our ideas do shape reality? That's why we came here. Um... So, question. Did we know Cornelius was with Athena? Did we already know that? I knew it! Athena's here. She built this. That other voice. Was that Cornelius? It definitely sounded like him. Come to think of it, he went on a research expedition around the time Athena vanished. He was gone for years. People thought he'd died. And all this time, he knew where she was? We should talk to him. We will, when we get back. But right now, we have to focus on finding Athena. We are so close. I wanted to check if that door override opened that other door, but it did not. Dreams are usually nightmares. The yikes, Perfurious. Well, I can hear footsteps, but I think it's just me turning around like I can hear. I guess they just did answer my question. Is this what I think it is? It is. Are those surfaces magnetic? No, nope. it's anti-gravity. Your coot was right. I should have known. So obviously we saw this in the, uh, or this scene, we saw a bit of this in the trailer, one of the trailers at least, which is okay, interesting. I'm over here. Hold on. I'll open that door for you. You're over where, Byron? Oh, there you are. Lesion gel. Interesting. Byron? Oh, I think I missed him. Was he walking on the magnetic surfaces by any chance? Same pattern as before. Three beams, three receivers. I guess we know what to do. Be careful. The sheer amount of power running through this place. I'll take care of this puzzle. You do the other two, okay? Does he even this know what he's doing? Maybe Alexandra Drennan was right. Play is part of what makes us human.
<laughs> Maybe I'll just like sit here and let him do all the work. You know, I've let, let's be honest, I've solved like all of the puzzles up to now. Nobody else has done any work. They've just walked around the world. They've just kind of like scanned bits here and scanned bits there. So, um, yeah, maybe I just, maybe, maybe I just sit back, get back, and just watch somebody else do, do some stuff, all right? I do wonder, like, whether or not he will solve, he would solve all the puzzles. 